big, big girl. And here's our nicest little eater. She's just so gentle and so slow. Can't miss the spoon. Oh yeah, there you go. Clean that part up. Mm-hmm. There you go, Parsons. Where's that piece? Right there. Where's that? Right there. pretty hard when you're the baby, eh? The baby of the group. Mm-hmm. There. There you go. Yeah. She's a very good girl. Precious. You wait, Blake. Yours is coming too. There you go. Yep, this is a great way to do it when it slows them down a little bit. They appreciate it a little bit once in a while. And also, it teaches them that everybody gets some. So you get rid of the competition for food. But sometimes dogs can get somewhat aggressive. Or I can finish my bowl the first so I can have yours. It helps in that way. So when you do put bowls down on the floor, everybody has their own bowl and they eat their own food. Oh, and if you notice the plastic spoon I'm using, yeah, it actually is the same as a baby spoon, but dog's little teeth are just as important, and you don't want metal hitting metal just in case. So you keep it plastic coated so you can protect it a little bit. It also teaches young pups all the way up a little bit of patience if you do this once in a while. Because this little one's just one years old. There's little precious. There's little precious. Always a good girl. Mm-hmm. And you're waiting for your big thing, aren't you? Aren't you? Yeah. You're waiting for your big thing, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, get this one. Good girl. And there you go. You clean it up. It works great if you're uh, traveling and you're in a car and you know that they need to have a bit of a meal, etc. You know, rather than being upset about the traveling, etc. It gives them a way to calm down, too. Good girl. 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 Good girl.